Okay, so in the last step we set up our about page, which has a pricing table at the bottom button that takes us to the contact page. So there's not much we need to do on this one, but one thing that's annoying is the auto scroll. So we can turn that off. We'll move the map marker and center it into Sydney. We'll set up the contact form and edit the details here. So we go into edit page on the contact page. Go into the full width map. So we're going to do theme park double play. Okay, that's how we want the map to look at the start. And we're going to turn off the auto zoom. Mouse wheel zoom, I mean. Okay, so we need to go in and add the map. So, PT PT Trainers Sydney. So, type in your address and find, and you see it will find your location and add a marker. I want to zoom out to there and save the map. Next, we need to go in the contact form. You can display the capture, which uh, means people have to type in a number, solve a simple sum to show they're not a robot. So you put your email address in here where the form should be sent to. We can leave the get in touch form. Edit the title. Save that. This is just a standard text field. Change your address. Phone number, business hours. Done. Preview the changes. You can see we've got the map marker in Sydney. It doesn't scroll in when you try to scroll down. So you have to use the these ones. Here's the capture. So you have to answer one plus seven. Submit. Craig when you submit, thanks for contacting us. Okay, and that's the contact page. Next we'll go in and write a blog post and then we're almost finished.